you know today early in the morning i just cooked some russians to eat them you know so as before i could prepare them or fry them uh my brother asked please include me also put one for me so in the process when i was trying to separate them as they were coming from a deep freeze um they were frozen and i wanted to separate them and you know russians they'd be attached to one another so i took a knife in the process of trying to detach them from one another i cut my hand like uh, i don't know if you can see it here can you see it can you see it this side you see yeah i cut my hand yeah this side just here just here so yes i remember when after cutting my hand i showed my brother that you see like i've cut my hand had you not asked me to also include you obviously i wouldn't have attempted to separate them i would have taken enough for me i wouldn't it wouldn't have happened but it's because you asked me to include you so it put me in the danger because i had to do something extra so listen it's the same thing sometimes if you can sit back you'll realize that had you not met that guy had you not met that person you wouldn't have been in that trouble you wouldn't have been in a position where maybe they beat you up and someone maybe they injure you permanently had you not taken that ride that day you wouldn't have had that car accident had this not happened had you not gone there that is why there are some people you must be aware of they are sent by satan himself like jesus judas iscariot was in the life of jesus was one of the disciples but he was responsible for the betrayal he was the one who sold jesus out meaning had jesus not known anything he would have easily sat down black if judas was not in my cycle i wouldn't have been sold out they wouldn't have known where i was so there are people who are sent by satan himself just to come and ruin your future, to ruin your life, to cause havoc. But here I'm praying for you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, that every messenger of Satan that has been put in your life, whether it's a friend, whether it's through your love life, whether it's your marital life, you get married to the wrong person. In Jesus' mighty name, I pray that may God make you to be aware. May God help you to get out of every person who is there as a messenger of Satan to come and ruin your life, to get out of your cycle right now. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I pray for you. Amen. Hallelujah. And of course, that's all I had. I'm Ishmael N. And see you next time.